Hi Aquarius, welcome to this Tower Love reading. My name's Sophia. Welcome to this community. So I'm going to do a new spread today. I'm going to jump straight in and see what's going on with Aquarius. <clears throat> Let's see what's going on with Aquarius. What's going on with Aquarius? interesting huh. all right what's happening here <clears throat> uh okay so this is the main overall the now page of cups crossed by the king of wands so i think you're hoping you're emotionally connected with your person at the moment so you wishing that they come with a small offer well a big offer really but you know even if it's small come away and the obstacle is you're hoping that they come away from whatever that structure they're in that could be a religion but i feel it could be they work all the time they're using that as an excuse or the work they're in or where they are at home I don't think it's to do with someone else. I feel it's work. The walls are closing in. There's something here. But like I said, the heart of it is you really want them to come stop that. You think that's an obstacle? You want them to stop that and come start with a small something with you. The subconscious, mm, interesting, is three of pentacles. Subconscious is generally stuff we never work on, although the subconscious overrides everything we think about anyway in the mind and everything. But you want to collaborate, right? Um, so, and I don't feel with your person because it's the heart, like with a team of people who are wise. But subconscious, you're not doing it. So you could literally know about this community because, uh, to be honest, I don't know who else you would collaborate with because no one else has anything to collaborate to, right? But you want to collaborate, say, for example, with this community and join mission, but you're not. Subconsciously, most people don't do it, and this is something that is not happening, but it's like this might be taking long, so you're like, well, in the meantime, yeah, it obviously makes sense if I collaborate. But there's failure here, so let's get to that. But let's do this one first. Recent past is <clears throat> two of pentacles. Trying to balance out your emotions. So you, you've got so much love for this person. You're trying to balance it out, trying to move forward, trying to control your emotions, but it's not working, right? Um All it was was an up and down, in and out, unbalanced relationship, right? That's a recent past. Hopes and goals is that's what I said at the beginning. Interesting. Hopes and goals is uh, seven of pentacles, but I understand now. So you're hoping that this working, working, working fails. The seven of pentacles is like eight. And eight of pentacles is hard work. So you're hoping that they drop a pentacle, two of pentacles, right? Drop one to make it more stable. And so it will be what then they will probably have time or something. Leave the job, change the job, less hours to see you. That's your hopes and goals. The near future, the high priestess. And what I got straight away is be realistic, right? High priestess is about everything that is inside the high priestess is knowing without evidence for example electricity it works right but there's no proof of what is you know there's no actual proof of it so this is about knowing uh tapping into your high priestess energy and working on that that's the near future so maybe you might start i don't know maybe you'll collaborate as well join us you're welcome to email lorraine or andrew any community this one I like. How is this affecting the situation? How are you affecting the situation? Empress. So you're trying to love yourself, nurture yourself. So that's a good thing. How others affecting the situation? Not great. Night of 
Knight of Cups. So other people may be influencing you by saying you need to get someone else who's a knight in shining armor, right? Cussing out this twin flame person, right? That's not good because you're twin flame. You can't pull that shit out of you, right? That's who you are. Unfortunately, that's who you are. Two of Swords, long term, not great because of uh, Two of Swords is the long term. Uh, a long term outcome, and that's indecision. So it looked great, but then it went downhill. But I'll clarify a few cards. Then I'll pull out advice from Spirit and what your person feels about you. I'll close it off with what they would like to tell you as well. So let's do a little clarifying and then I'll move to the other things. So let's clarify. I kind of know this, kind of know that, kind of know that. Two of Pentacles. Let's clarify the recent past. What happened? Why did this happen like this? Why is this this two of Pentacles, this juggling, this this try you trying to balance out your life? Why wasn't it moving forward and all this kind of stuff? Two of Pentacles, clarify, Knight of Swords, Chariot, Seven of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles twice. So, it failed in the past because you didn't invest and do the inner work. You just wanted it, you, you were communicating with your person and you thought that was enough. Well, they're communicating, maybe they communicated that they will move forward. So you thought it would move forward. But talking, there was no action, but you didn't take action. So both of you didn't take action, seven of pentacles, right? And you might say, yeah, I want you to be with my person. No, you're watching me, you're twin flame. Twin flames know about mission. Are you doing mission? You know you have to, right? Three of pentacles is here, collaborate, but you're not, you weren't doing it. And you're, I don't think you're doing it now with the outcome. Hopes and goals is seven of pentacles. I kind of know what that is. Let me talk more about the high priestess then. What's this? What what are you uh, near future? So there's a change that is coming, right? If you haven't already, you started to tap in because maybe your person is not communicating with you anymore. So you have to go within. This is to do with the inner child, I feel as well. Ace of Wands, Magician, Ten of Wands. When you tap in, when you go in, so maybe that helps you, you know that this is a twin flame and that they're passionate about you and all that kind of thing with the Ace of Wands and that you can manifest that, right? And why there is a burden here, Ten of Wands. Because the High Priestess is clarified by the Ace of Wands, the Magician card and Ten of Wands. So this burden of this twin flame endeavor, you manifest it and you will know that when you go within instead of blaming your person. And trying to control it, right? That's why maybe that's what you have to do because maybe your person isn't talking to you about it. So uh, let's clarify the two of swords. Why is because when you're doing great here, actually, you're not. So I want to clarify the empress because if it says how you are affecting the situation now, if you really was the empress, this wouldn't be happening. So what are you missing? You could be all cards. Have negative and positive. You could be the negative side of the Empress, right? It doesn't have to be reverse. It could just be a negative or positive. Some people reverse it and say it as a negative. So let's see what you're doing because that's affecting this situation with the Empress. The Empress is clarified by the Strength card, the Six of Cups and the Nine of Swords. So yeah, you're just... Okay... So there's an expectation of, okay, I'll just stay over here working myself. So I don't know what you're doing, but it's not proper work because it's a nightmare. Because all you're doing is reminiscing on the past, right? And hoping your person has the strength to come towards you. So basically, you're like, okay, this is failed. So I'm going to go over here and love myself, which when they used to say that, I used to think, what the fuck is that? I had no idea. Hence why I started to make my programs for me. I didn't make, I didn't I had no intention of making a community. Everyone said, well, well, love themselves, love yourself, love and light. And I thought, what the hell does that mean, right? And that started working on me. But you're not doing that, right? Because Nine of Swords is here. So whatever you're doing, you're just pulled away and feel, oh, well, I'll pull away from this. And that's loving myself. Literally, that's all you've done, right? It's just, just pulled away. 
and that's why it's a nightmare and why you're over there doing nothing right not transmuting not working on yourself sexual abuse abandonment neglect to a sort now that's why the final outcome is to a sort because this empress is not so you're kidding yourself that yeah i'm loving myself because i'm not involved with that situation this is bullshit spirituality of turning the other cheek which does nothing Real spirituality is face your fears, right? Face it. Face it your person is working all the hours. Face it if they've got a third party. Face it. Then you can transmute it. Then you move forward. You're not. So the Two of Swords is clarified by that. But let's close it out with the Two of Swords and find out what your person feels about you and advice from spirit, right? So let's see if the Two of Swords... Oh, I know the Two of Swords. They just told me. So the Two of Swords is you know your twin flame. But you also know that uh, um, the truth is you're not you're not going in with the high priestess. You're not working on yourself, right? The final long-term outcome is you're not working on yourself. You're not connecting with your sexual abuse. You're closing off your heart. You don't want to see anything. Like I said, avoidance. Avoidance here. And that's the final outcome. So I would say the advice from spirit here in the near future is to keep going within. But let's see what your person would uh, feels about you, right? And then I'll get advice from spirit and close it out with what they would want to tell you. So what does your person feel about you? Because they're not in this, they're not here, right? They're not in this reading. There's a separation here. Ten of Swords, King of Pentacles, Hangman. So <clears throat> how does your person feel about you? How can that be? I'll, I'll put it how... <coughs> I'll, I'll change it then. Okay, I'm going to stay over here working in this situation, right? Because I've already got people stabbing me in the back. And, my, and you just want me to leave this situation, this work, this commitment I have, right? To stab these um, uh, friends and family in the back. But it doesn't matter. Just say you're in a relationship. I'll, I'll put it this way. Say you're in a relationship that treats you bad. You don't want other people to treat that person bad because you're still loved and connected to them. So this person, even though they know people are treating them bad, that's like your twin flame. People are here saying, get rid of that twin flame. Go and get someone nice. He's cheating on you, working a million hours, not leaving the relationship, not leaving the wife. Would you want someone to go and be horrible to your twin flame, even because what they're doing? So that's what your expectation is, and that's what your person knows, right? So they're staying still. They're not moving, right? That's how they feel about this, right? Because you're supposed to be um, going forward and doing your own thing, which let's get some advice from spirit. So you could be saying to your person, Leave the, leave the job. Leave the situation. Advice from spirit. Oh, here they are. Pretty quick. <clears throat> from source, from upstairs, from the galactic, the celestials. The advice is six of swords, nine of swords, world. Right? You can keep trying to push forward, like I said, with this fake-ass empress, right? And But all you're getting is a negative. And look, ten of swords, they've got other people influencing them. You've got other people influencing you, right? That could be literally YouTube saying, love and light, turn the other cheek, or get someone better, you can do better, which if they're a spiritual guru, they would know that you attracted this, right? If they're a spiritual guru, they would know that past life contracts, 5D, twin flame, right? So you're, you're, you're going towards nightmare, listening to other people. The spirit's advice is you need to start over. Go inside, like I said, but I bet your spirit's advice will be high priestess. She's in the world. The zero point is full card. And zero is, um, the zero is connected with um, the, the, the spirit, guitar, right? Higher consciousness, connected to the fool's card. So st start over, jumping in, taking in a new beginning, a new loop of faith, and going in your inner world. High priestess, like I said, inner world. So let's close it out with what he or she would say to you. 
definitely need help with these readings. Why do you think I created? They guided me, right, to create mission. They guided me. I did. This was not a business in, endeavor of mine. I was just like most. Okay, they started me off guiding me doing tarot. Then I made my programs to help me, right? And then I thought, well, mission is uh, being humanitarian, right? And then others wanted to be like me, so I made mission. I made it so you, which you know, three pentacles, subconscious here, you're supposed to be collaborating. You can go to the website, go to the Facebook group and get help. Not just getting an extended or a personal reading is not help. After this reading, this resonates. How does this help you? You need to move forward. And there's others in there. If you're like, oh, you're too fresh, Sophia, you're going to cuss me out. Well, I don't actually do image readings or counselling anymore. So pick the others in the community who are not like me, fresh, all right, that you can book. But they have my program, right, which I 100% money back guarantee. See, look at this. I'm not giving up. I don't know what to do. I still check up on you. So if they're checking up on you, give them something to check up on, right? They're looking at you, they're spying on you. Give them something to look at. What are you doing, right? Build a community. Be a humanitarian. Do something, right? There's not going to be any change. This is all that's going to keep doing. They're just going to keep spying on you, spying on, on you. And not giving up means that there's hope. But, you know, I, I hope to fly to the moon. Ones are action. And you're the emotions. This planet is energy. And energy means that you lead. The whole of this is the high priestess. As within, so without. So you work on this crap that's within you, two of swords, and work on loving yourself properly. If you don't know what it is, book us for counselling, not me. And then you attract this without. Speak to you later.